Greetings guy, another hamster sand review, Vitacraft sandy, suitable for chinchillas, yes that's it, drop it why don't you, no. chinchillas, hamsters, gerbils, etc, so we'll uh, get this opened and we'll see what it's like, it's also got vitality plus, so yes we'll see what happens so get this bad boy opened right guys you can see my fingerprints in there <laughs> this is absolutely lovely now this does remind me of the old tiny friends one before they changed it look at that now, I've heard some good reviews about this, like, and some people said they've been using it for their hamsters for years. So, there you go. Yes, um, lovely colour. Very, very, very soft. And this will make the hamsters fur lovely. It's just exactly the same as the, uh, oh, it's even making my fingers feel lovely and soft. It's exactly like the tiny friends used to be. There you go, guys. Leaves no residue. Look at that, no residue. It's just, uh, your fingers feel nice and soft. Leaves a nice, like, soft film on your skin. So I can imagine what it'd be like for the hamsters' coats. Now, um, I can't say anything more about it. I, I love the colour. It's lovely. I'll put some of this in the, uh, the cages tonight, except for Casper's. Because Casper, I can't trust him because of his... Um, his bad coordination, if he falls in it, because he'll try and attempt to tumble, you know, like they do, where they tipple over to do the, the usual bath. And he won't be able to get back up again, and I don't want him ingesting all the... So what I'll do with him, I'll set some in a separate tub, and when he's come out uh, for playtime, what I'll do is I'll just put him in the tub, and then I'll just go like that, rub it in his fur... And then uh, he'll still get his little sand bath and I'll, and I'll be there to monitor him. <clears throat> but it's a shame because he used to love his sand bath. He used to be dead funny because he used to go like that, you know, like dwarfs do, <laughs> wash the backs. But he can't do that now because he, his coordination's really bad because of his ears. So it looks like it. Um, the coordination bit is due to his vestibular... <clears throat> But we know the rest of his problems are due to his teeth. So anyway, that's Casper. He'll be he'll still have his sand bath, but I'll be doing it for him. And uh so I can keep him monitored because I have a fear if I just left his sand bath in. You know, if I put a sand bath in, he'd go for it automatically, he'd go in and he'd he'd go over and then he won't get up again and he'd he might panic, he might swallow the sand, and there's oh it's just all them fears. <laughs> But Archie and uh, Arabella, I'll uh, I'll be able to leave the sand baths in for them. I think Archie will love it. <laughs> but yeah, this is lovely. Got no complaints about this, guys. Nine out of t no, not nine. Ten out of ten. Sorry. The packaging. <clears throat> there you go. How many kilograms is? It? Oh, it's one kilogram, guys. So that's quite good. Quite good. And uh, and it does say it's suitable for hamsters as well, so nothing to worry about there, guys. And it's... Uh, was it a bad price either? Can't remember off by hand, but it was, it was only a few pounds. <clears throat> so it's, uh, it's about the same as the Tiny Friends. But... Uh, as you know, I won't be doing tiny friends or because I don't want to put any hamsters at risk. But uh, and we all know what tiny friends look like anyway, so I won't need to get that one. <clears throat> but 
but I will be getting BF, BFR and a couple of others. And I've still got the uh, Vasali Lager to do. Then I've done uh, the ones I've got in. <clears throat> but at the moment, this beats the JR Farm one as well. Definitely. So guys, I'll give you one more quick look. Because like I said, these sand reviews won't can't be, uh, won't be that long because they're not like food. But there you go, guys. There you go. No dust come off. No, I can't see any dust. If there is, there'll be uh, very little, which is, uh, as we know, we need to keep as little as possible. But yes, it's uh, there's none going up the sides there. So, I'm not doing the shake testing. This will go everywhere, but I think you know what I mean. But yeah. So I'll tell you what, I'll just give this a little bit of shake. There we go. Oh, it goes back straight again. But there you go, guys. There you go. So, yes. The Vitacraft Sandy. Don't if you can see that, guys. Finest mineral sand for bathing and digging. There you go, guys. <laughs> it's a cute little bot a uh, cute little packet as well <clears throat> right guys so there you go that's the sound review for uh today and uh yeah i'll see how they go with this one but i like this first impression right craft wins again 10 out of 10 <laughs> if anybody uses it guys comment below let me know what you think whether you like it or not because uh, like I said everyone's different it's okay if you don't like it it's okay if you do <clears throat> uh, but yeah uh, all, uh, the reviews seem pretty good and, uh, and I'm fairly impressed at the moment don't leave any dust on your fingers so yes it's nice and soft just like walking in sand at the beach <laughs> my hand's in it again there we go <laughs> yeah guys so there you go you can get this uh on amazon i think it's on zoo plus as well and um look for some deals on it uh, i think we're doing multi-packs as well so you can save some money there <clears throat> so yeah guys catch you later